Hey everybody, this is Linda and I hope you're having a great day. Today's message is the pursuit of happiness. And so normally what we do is we wait for a condition or a situation to change before we're going to be happy. Wrong. Can't do that. Because for one, we're coming from a place of lack. Two, when we're coming from a place of lack, it's going to be slow, but sure, it's going to take a really long time. Very slow to come if it's going to even come. Because as long as we're maintaining that vibration, there's no, there's no way to really manifest that because you're going to only manifest at the vibration that you're at. So if you are looking for a situation or a condition or a person to change, it is for you to change and you to be happy within yourself and find that happiness. So in other words, if you can be happy, like say you're desiring someone and you're wait, you know, you're just, oh my gosh, this person, I don't know if I'm going to ever find the person of my life and automatically I'm coming from a place of lack. But if I can envision this person, right, and feel what it feels like to be with that person, then I am raising my vibration. And I'm already happy because I'm already feeling what it feels like to be with that person. And that manifestation has to follow. I'm not saying it could happen right away. It could. Absolutely. But what I'm saying is that you're going to have to raise your vibration in order, right, to manifest things in your life. But if you are waiting, as like I said, if you're waiting for something to change, you're coming from a place of lack. So you find the happiness within yourself, right? Find that happiness or whatever, like if you're envisioning a job, feel what it feels like to be in that job, the people, you know, receiving a paycheck or if you're a soul, if you're an entrepreneur, feel what it feels like, right? To be in that, even if you're not an entrepreneur yet and you want to be and you want to leave your job, feel what that feels like to be that. And then that manifestation can follow. Because in reality, everything that we desire is already exists for us. As soon as you launch a desire, the universe is like, gotcha, I'm on it. It doesn't delay. It doesn't go, okay, wait a minute, I got a lot of people I got to take care of out here and you're going to have to wait. It doesn't do that. It's on it for us. It's done. But the universe is waiting for us our vibration to match our manifestation, to match that vibration. So that is the pursuit of happiness. If you want to have happiness in your life, be happy. Don't wait for a condition and then be happy. You know, I'll believe it when I see it. No. See it and then believe it. Raise the vibration you will see it and you're going to be like, oh my gosh. And it's funny because I don't know if this has happened to you, but for me, when I have attained things, and it could be small things, and I'm like, woohoo, all right, yay, thank you universe. And then it's like, okay, I'm ready for the next thing. Because we are in a creative, constant creative universe. And there are always going to be desires out there to attain always and so which I could really want to I want to tap into a little bit about that and it's still really in relationship to the pursuit of happiness but about contrast because when we have contrast then it launches a desire of what we do want right and so that goes out to the universe to say okay this is what I really this is what I want because we know what we don't want so that's my message for today, the pursuit of happiness. If you want the happiness, find that. Be that happiness. Find it, whatever that is that you are desiring. Get happy about it. Without it changing, without the condition, doing whatever it is that you want to do to attain it, to change it, get happy first. Find in, in pursuit of the happiness within yourself. So that's my message for today. And thank you for tuning in, and I hope to see you again. Love you.